Happy New Year guys! For the fresh New Year start, I'm going to put on a clean sheet that I just bought for our staff for Christmas. For the today's new year reset, I'm going to take down all the Christmas decorations which will be very simple because we just had in a few spots in our home but also I just want to have a fresh sheet. There's nothing better than that. Having a nice clean space is just a reset for the mind. I love linen sheets so the one that I purchased now it's a linen one and I got the duvet cover as well and I'm going to use some Charlie's soap I've been using this for 13 years I think and I didn't switch because I'm very happy with that a quick refill for the all-purpose cleaner which is just some water one drop of dish soap and some essential oils For the windows I'm using 50% water, 50% of vinegar and I'm pushing around the furniture because I just want to have a deep clean for the nice fresh start for the year. And as I was pushing away the furniture, uh, the bed, I was thinking hmm, maybe it would be better if I just put it in another place. <laughs> I always get this idea. Um, <laughs> and I had to let it out of my system but soon as I placed that there I saw it's just not gonna work for the flow so I need to push it back but it was fun to try it and I was able to clean that hard to reach areas Joet made this bench long long time ago and at some point I painted two white. I'm thinking to take off all the paint and have them back in a wood color and wood tone. So that's something in my plans. quick snack so I can have more energy and the orange wasn't enough so <laughs> I'm going to start to eat this pineapple upside down cake clean sheet clean floors as soon as I step into the room it has this fantastic fresh scent I just love this so much so I don't usually iron especially because it's a linen sheet so it's <laughs> all the effort would be wasted away very quickly because it wrinkles very fast but I like to iron the pillows it just makes that so much nicer and I have my back and forth with this curtain up and curtain down thing <laughs> I think it's because of the window so once we will replace these windows I will have an easier time to decorate this area but now I can't really decide if I should put up the curtain or not but today we're gonna go with the curtain I'm hoping that you stay
I used curtain rods to fix these uh, branches for Christmas decoration and I will have a very easy time to take them down. Another easy way to decorate for any occasion is to use some white chalk marker on the window and I'm getting questions how hard is to clean it and it's not hard, it's super easy. Basically I just use the vinegar water mixture. We use this fireplace from the morning to the night every single day so <laughs> that means we have to clean it quite often so we are just figuring out an easier way to clean it and uh, we take turns and that helps too. <laughs> starting to taking down the decoration from Christmas and I'm going to undecorate that tree as well so I can have a fresh start for the new decorations for winter and for Valentine's Day. I really don't decorate a lot for Valentine's Day just a little bit just to make it fun and I have some heart shaped ornaments and I'm going to use those. Flowers and bees talking about you Since I really like and prefer the natural materials, I like to pack all the ornaments in paper boxes. I mean, I don't put them into the garage because we don't have that many, so I'm able to find some space in the house for these. And I'm getting questions about these boxes. These are from IKEA. I think they have the best price for that, although they don't have this section ones anymore, sadly, because it was so functional. I don't know why I didn't make it anymore because it's just very useful. This is one of the garland that I used to make. Um, I made this years ago for the Scandinavian fair where I was selling my art. And I love these because I can fold them flat, but they can make a statement on the tree. So uh, it's a very easy way to decorate with that. And you have seen the hearts. I'm going to set those aside for Valentine's Day. years ago I had so many decorations for Christmas I mean I have a soft, soft spot for that anyway because I love to decorate <laughs> but I wanted to simplify things so I donated a bunch of those and I tried to come up with some creative way to decorate with and one of the elements is the paper they can go flat and they can be a beautiful decoration and the other one is to use a lots of natural elements like branches once we are done with that decoration i can just put it into the compost 
These itty bitty mini lights are also saving some space for me. This is gonna be messy, no matter how we're going to take it out. Yes, they are a few needles that are stayed on the tree, <laughs> but all the rest ended up on the floor. So I started to clean it with the vacuum cleaner, but it just started to clog it up. So I went back to the old fashioned way and I'm just using a broom. For the unbreakable ornaments that are not made out of glass, I like to use this sheet bag. So whatever sheet I bought, it just came in this bag and I'm just going to repurpose that to store the ornaments in there. Out of this decoration I only have to keep a handful of things it's just a little bells I'm going to keep this little yarn pieces that I use to fix the branches otherwise I'm going to compost those and I'm going to obviously keep the curtain rod as well but I'm going to reuse them throughout the year new year I'm going to work on balancing things better and just make a more preparation ahead for my day so this is one of them I actually mixed the pancake mix at night and the dough turned out so much better so this is one thing that I can get ahead in the morning it's a huge help also I have some pre-cooked oatmeal that I dressed up with some cherry powder and some passion fruit flakes that's the golden color that you can see but I'm going to try my best to balance the fun and the relaxing time for myself that I can set aside and also be more efficient with the work that I do I hope you having a great year so far I wish you all the best a great heart lots of smile for this year and I will see you guys soon in the next video 
拜。